Hey everyone, it's Ken here from Northern Viking Everyday. I hope you're doing well. Today we're gonna to be showing you how to convert your photos to JPEG. So maybe you have photos in all sorts of different file types. Today we'll show you how to convert those to JPEGs. We'll be doing this on a Windows 11 PC, but it should be very similar on a Windows 10 PC as well. So let's go ahead and dive right into it. All right, so here we are on my Windows 11 desktop. And again, the process should be very similar in Windows 10. Now I happen to have five photos here on the left-hand side and they're all the same photo, but of different file types. And this first one here is a PNG. These are from a recent trip we took to the Caribbean. Now I've got a PNG, I've got a BMP, I've got a .tiff, I've got a HEIC, which is common for you iPhone users out there. And we have a WebP. Now these file types will probably cover about 99% of you. Now there are some more obscure photo file types that this method won't work for you today. I do wanna point you in the right direction. So I like to use a program called paint.net. Hopefully that program works out for you. You can check it out or Google that program and find more information. Now let's go ahead and dive right into converting these over to JPEG. So the software we're gonna be using today is included with Windows, it is the Paint program. So if you head on down to the Start menu here at the bottom and just left click on that and you go to All Apps right here, you should be able to search through here for Paint under the letter P. There it is, Paint right there. I also have Paint 3D, but we're gonna be using Paint today. So let's go ahead and left click on Paint and it's gonna load that up. So many of you may have used paint before to draw on pictures, that sort of thing. Now in here, we need to bring our photo in and there's a couple different ways to do that. So we can just go to file and we can go to open right here or hit control O. And this will allow us to search our computer for our image to bring it in here. That would be the first way. The second way would be to drag and drop our image right in here, just like that. And the third way, I'm actually just gonna close this down, would be to actually just go to our image. And this is probably the fastest way. We're gonna right click on our image, a little menu should pop up. And in here we should say, see open with, and the menu looks slightly different in Windows 10, but there is an open with. So again, that's right click on the image, not left click, open with, and you should see the option that says paint right here. Just go ahead and left click on paint and it's gonna load that up. Now you can see it's extremely zoomed in on our photo here. So what we're gonna do is hit the control key on our keyboard, so control. And with the center wheel on your mouse, you can scroll that out and you should be able to see your image a little bit better there. So just scroll that wheel while holding the control key. So you've got that in there. You can see that's a PNG file up here in the corner that's loaded into paint. If we wanted to um, move a different file in here, we could just drag it in and drop it as well. And I'll control and scroll that wheel. And you can see that it's a BMP, so that one works. A .tiff will work. An HEIC, we'll just keep dropping these in so you can see that they're all working in here. So that one's an HEIC up there. And then we've got the WebP here as well. So we're gonna drop that in there. Um, and it's gonna look something like this. Now, once you've got your photo in here, you, you could do some customization to it. Maybe you wanted to draw on it, you could do that. Um, you can do that. We're not going to get into that today. But from here to convert any of these file types to a JPEG, you would go up to the file option here in the top left hand corner. We're going to left click on that. And in here, you should see the option that says save as right here. And when you hover over save as there's a little drop down and you should see the JPEG picture option here. And I know the Windows 10 version of Paint looks slightly different, but you should be able to figure it out from what I'm doing here. So go ahead and left click on JPEG picture under the save as option. And it's gonna bring up a save as um, tool here for you. So in here, you can see at the bottom, it says save as type JPEG. You could switch it to a different type if you wanted to save it to GIF or PNG. You could easily do that in there. We're gonna leave that on JPEG. And you can change the file name here as well. So it automatically went to beach.jpg. We're gonna change that to, why don't I um, type final in there so we know that that's the, the different one. And from there, you can select your location. I'm gonna just save mine to my desktop, but if you wanna save it in your documents, you can easily do that as well. Go ahead and hit save here. 
Now this type of file, a WebP has the option to have transparency in it. There's no transparency in this photo. So if there is transparency for this file type, it will give you a pop-up so that you might lose that. This wouldn't happen if you're using say a PNG, this probably wouldn't happen to you. So we're just gonna go ahead and hit okay here. And you can see that that final beach.jpg popped up here. So let's go ahead and open that up. It opened up in my photos and you can see that it is a JPEG file here. So really it is that simple to convert your photos to JPEGs here on a Windows computer. So I hope this quick tutorial helped you convert your photos to JPEGs. If it did, make sure to give this video a thumbs up. Also remember to connect with me on social media and subscribe here on YouTube. I'd love to have you join the Northern Viking community. Thank you so much for watching today and until next time, take care.